Give me a minute, everyone. Haha. <laughs> Come on, get me on. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> You're right, everyone. Pick a mix gamer here. Today we're uh, basically starting Kingdom New Crowns. I've just got past the first one. I am going to try and do Land 5 again, but I think I might have to go back to Land 4 to get more people because I think the stronger monsters come a little bit quicker than, you know, like on the other islands. So I'm definitely going to. Sorry, I'm just putting my phone on silent. I'm definitely going to have to um, get some more people over again, you know, before I do anything. But we are playing Kingdom 2 Crowns, and in this one, you can do it online with a friend or solo, it's up to you. But I bought the DLC, and you can either have Norse Lands, which is Viking, Kingdom 2 Crowns, which is the normal, you know, the, the normal settings of the game, <clears throat> Kingdom Shogun, I think it says. Shogun? It, I think it, it's either Japanese or Chinese. Mm -hmm. And Kingdom Deadlands. I'm not actually sure what that one is, because I've not actually heard of that one before. But I'm going with this one. Kingdom Shogun, I think it is. Yeah. Do I have to get a man? Can I get a queen? Ugh, I think we just have to get a man. Nothing wrong with men, but I do prefer to choose my own person. Oh, there we go! Yeah, if you press the X button... No, it, it was a queen! Oh my god. It was a queen. Hmm. Now, well, we're stuck with the king for now. See, there's a queen right there, and I wanted her. Kingdom Two Crowns. Oh, look at that background. Beautiful. Lots of lovely bamboo. I must admit, though, I like in the background how they're actually putting a queen and a king there. So they're not just like... Come along, people. Does anyone ever wonder where these people actually come from? The one with the bloody stars. But they have improved a lot in this game compared to the other one. It's basically the same sort of basic thing, but they have improved it. To give you more coins at the beginning, so you can basically have a chance of building both sides sort of thing, you know, instead of just like leaving it to chance. Follow you, okay. Where am I following you to exactly? I'm following. Following. I know, darling. I don't know why she wants me to follow. What the hell? You've brought me all the way here and I can't even get past that. Are you sure you're not an Oni? Are you sure you're not a demon? Seriously. You've done all this now and I've got to try and get back in time 
to build the other side of the fence without the bloody monsters attacking me. Ugh! <clears throat> Mind you, from what I know, bamboo is actually quite a good source material to build things with. I think you meant to bring me to these people here, didn't you? I think that's where you meant to bring me. And you screwed up royally. I like how all the animals here are like Japan and are Chinese based as well. Stand here. Okay, wasted my last coin on a tree there. It's my uh Okay. No I didn't. More coins magically appeared. Happened to me first, Bowman. Well, either way. Get that bill. <laughs> Just in case. Right, he's a trader. Those coins with uh, the circles in them, there's a name for them. I don't know what they're called, though. I don't know if they're called yen or. You know what I mean? I can't remember which one they're called. Also, the days seem to last a little bit longer. Right, I think this, I think you can cut it down, that. But I think it's the same before, you have to leave at least one tree. It's like I said, Kingdom 2 Crowns, as much as it has been improved, I've not actually played it as much as the first one, so I'm not sure if certain things are still um, the same, so to speak. But obviously that's the nearest camp, so I'm not getting rid of it yet. I'm just making more wild life space, so to speak. But I do like how the games do last longer, because it's like now... The sun's not absolutely dragging on, sort of. No, absolutely rushing by, sorry. So, it's actually a lot easier, this, you know, to plan out, sort of thing. Yes, come along, person. You're with me. Oh, let's take a quick nosy down here while I've got the chance, then. And in the second game... like I need a diamond or a gem. But in the second game you can destroy the main gates properly but I think you've got to learn from what I remember because I never got round to destroying them and I asked my brother about it and he says you've got to discover how to make bombs and then you've got to take them in the action. Ah! Uh, boy, this ain't good. Right, so there's another person's hut down there which is good. We've at least found that. Come on, my king. Oof, sorry. Cheap creeps again. Right, keep an eye out for two diamonds, because that looks like something good. <coughs> Trader's hook. Oh, bloody hell, don't do that, don't do that. The monsters are literally right behind you.
think I'd prefer a few more builders. Just in case. Day two? I think I want more builders just because purely because of him there then. If he's on his own consistently trying to do this. I forgot to give the trader the money but my wildlife scouts should be okay for now. But if I can, I want to try and get those builders. I know, sweet that. Those builders that are like down there. Not builders, sorry, people. Because then at least if they're on the way up. Mm -mm. I know, you sound like you're in pain and I want to help, but I don't know where to get the diamonds from. These people should get back on time. That looks like a bow and archer man. Looks like, don't know for definite, but it's just the way he's got his arms. You know, just like stretching it like that, so I think, get the impression that's a bow and arrow. Oh, treasure chest! Yay! portal main portal only in this one they can be destroyed if you know how to make bombs so sorry hang on one of my eyelashes is a bit weird so yes right side main portal we just take a rest instead. It's not like we have to run from the monsters just yet. Yay! Now, I've no idea where those two new people are. I don't know if I've run past them or not. But, as long as they're safe -ish. And again, the horse on the first land will do for a time, but obviously his stanima, his stanima, sorry, and his running time, it is limited. So, as soon as you can sort of trade up sort of thing, you're probably best doing that. Sounds nasty to say, I do know, but, yeah. And you know what? We may as well grab you while we're at it. Are there any more people here? No? Okay. Oh, I could have upgraded it. Oh, that hurts. Wow, they got here fast. Bowman! and give me a minute. Sorry, just trying to pick a bit of a new design. too green. Yeah. Yeah, that looks alright. So aggressive. It's not like the first one, this. They batter themselves into it. Meh! Meh! <laughs> You're like there looking at me as if to say, oh, oh, oh. Remind me of a bloody chill hour. Right. So, there's nothing on this side as of yet that we know of. 
main gate's on that side. I didn't see the boat either, so I'm assuming it's on the left side. Ooh, same direction as the pier, so that's good then. <laughs> Come on, builders, when you've got a minute. See, this is what's useful about having loads of builders. You can literally just get stuff knocked down quick. What I like about this though as well is that in this one they're not necessarily limited so to speak to the actual um, trees. They tend to go, even if it is just slightly, they tend to go past the trees. You know, just to, so that's where it's good, where it does improve it a bit as well. But yeah, this is just like a test here. Not a test, that's a bit of a wrong way of wording that, but like, um, yeah, just to see how I do, you know, just while I get the hang of it on. Obviously keeping an eye on time as well. It's like they fitted a lot more they fit sorry, a lot more detail into the screen, you know like before in the first one. I think you could zoom in and out, you know, if you wanted to, whereas in this one, it's like they've fitted loads, look, they, they've fitted, sorry, loads more into the square that's there sort of thing, so when you're looking, it's just loads more detail, you've got the background, the trees, the river, the reeds on the river, you know, you've got all sorts, which is good. Yeah, we'll aim back. Come on, your majesty. We have to get back. I know. I was going to say, is that a raccoon, that or um, is there a different name for it? And also, the animals are based on animals that are in Japan. Because I think they are. I think whichever one you pick, it's based on those people. So in the Vikings one, it'd be Vikings themed animals. Ooh, nice one. Mm, Alright then. Let's inch a little bit closer. Right, so we need stone to do that one. People forgot about the people. How could I forget about the people? Right. So they're there. Right, go back for these people again. Because they seem to actually get to the camp quite quick, don't they? That's what I bloody know it. Two. Right, so I counted 14 breaths from the horse then, so I don't know if that's a good way to, like, do the stamina sort of thing, but we'll just say. Look at them, they're just 
just pegging it back? They never did that in the first one, did it? It was just like strolling along. I don't want to knock that down just yet because I know obviously it's good that we're getting a lot of people but in reality and I'd rather get another builder just to be safe. Ooh, I didn't have enough. Flipping heck. Oh yeah, go on Drader. I was wondering when I could give you money so you could come back again. Oh wait, no, 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 I won't upgrade it yet, because they might start doing something to the fences and we ain't got time for that. All oh, right, another person here flipping it. Okay, another bowman then. Leveled this up yet to a second wall. I thought you already did it. I was gonna say, you give me the money when we get in there. I thought we already did that though. I'm sure we already did that. Or did you think the it enough so it downgraded it again? Ooh, that would be awful, that. Does that mean you got to keep upgrading your walls? Like, literally keep upgrading them. Oh, there's another person there. Flipping heck. <coughs> I did not realise how many people were in this camp. Ah, right. No, I know what we've done now. That was the first wall. That's the one we upgraded. Second wall. Bloody hell, it's a good job I saw that then. Ding, 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 ding. Still ten coins. <clears throat> oh, I love the little house that's there. Clouds brushed it side a bit. You're covering up the background. A little. Yes, come along, people. Much more to clear. No oh, bloody hell. But obviously we need to keep in mind as well that we need the wildlife to keep getting money. But in Kingdom 2 Crowns as well, this is what I forgot to point out. Kingdom 2 Crowns, you will get a winter. Right, so make sure you've got farmers because wildlife will not come in winter. So you won't get any money from that. I think farming... Stop misbehaving. I think farming to an extent lasts through the winter to an extent you know to a limited thing but still just don't spend too long on an island because you will have to deal with the winter ooh, ooh. thank you my builders thank you oh, first land's always the easiest Okay, 
think this is probably not the difficult part, but the complicated part. Like you'll get to a point where it looks like you only have to knock down five trees. But you have to knock down like loads of them. No point carrying on because it's getting near night time. There she is, the beautiful queen and the beautiful king. And the bow! The bow, everyone! Ah! Ah, one crown broken in half. So it's either to signify a unison, like, <clears throat> no, I don't know if a unison is the right word actually, to signify a partnership, not necessarily marriage, but I think this is more or less pointing out that to get somewhere on this game, you can get quicker results if you work together, and that's how, you know what I mean, sort of thing. Yes, get inside. Okay, okay, lots of coins. We never said we'd be ungrateful for him, but we did have to sort of watch a little bit. So I'll sort of give these a few. Make these a few. Because these are going to have some. Right, I think they've already took care of the enemies. people there, there. Don't run off with the coins. <laughs> it's like he's just there, isn't it? Yes, I will become a citizen. I'm taking these too. You are, you are a coin. <laughs> Start off, mate. <laughs> I know. Oh, I want to wait for that one so much, but I don't know where to find the diamonds, and that's a bit. <laughs> Right, take a few breaths and then we'll get the other citizens. Excuse me, everyone. A minute. There we go. Yay! I sometimes wonder what it would actually look like in a swamp area. You know, imagine if you just walked into it and it's all greenery around you, but like dark and murky at the same time. Oh, I am so glad, I'm so glad these run back. Seriously, I'm not joking with you. I don't know if there's any other camps, so, you know, on the left side. If I can get that before I leave, I'm getting it. I want to know what it is. Sounds like he's in pain. Me little baba. Yes, come along, builders. Come along. Builders, bowmen. Right, stop taking your bloody coins. I appreciate the help, I really do. But seriously, no. Same time tomorrow. Where's my banker? There he is. Save the funds. Treat them nicely. Hmm. Oh, bows and arrows are gone. Okay, got four more archers. That's not bad. Right, I think what we'll do tomorrow... Actually, we'll do it today. We've got enough builders. It's not like we're scraping on our builders. We should get this done for tonight. Especially with two working on it. Yeah. 
out. Yeah. And we'll build up a little farm as well. Yeah. builders get it built but I think because there's a lot more involved in this game as well I think it's it's not just gonna be like I don't think it's gonna be a land per video maybe I'm, I'm not too sure yet oh my god oh you can upgrade it again it's not just limited to <laughs> right so we're missing a girl it looks like and we can't do anything till we find her. Fair enough. Mm. No, we'll lose the wildlife, won't we, if I do that? Don't want to lose that yet. Oh, bloody hell, can we get more in there? I know the ship was near uh... There we go. Yes, 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 yes. Right, so if I start getting rid of these ones now. And then they'll do those trees and then start to do these ones and then by the time they've done these ones they can do more of those trees. We've not run into one demon gate yet, have we? Uh, that's what I would do, though. I'd clear a chunk of the land on whichever side's not the main portal one. And then what I'd do is, obviously, you'll have a load of wildlife there. And then just very gradually move your fences forward. So then it's like you're protecting yourself because the main ones have to get through those fences before they can actually get to you sort of thing but at the same time you're not wasting resources trying to do it all on the other side right i'll just do it to there because obviously it's nearly night time and we have got to think slightly here because I forgot we're more near uh, they set off a bit early don't we? and we're sort of more near the demon gate now so yeah I might have buggered this up a little bit only a little bit thank you my good sirs sort of limited to how much I can collect though people so yeah like now I'm so tempted to build this fence here to crack on with it all but as soon as we've cleared all of it it still doesn't change the fact that I still need the wildlife to give me money to build the boat so yeah but I think I might get this one built I also like the fact that the fences now aren't too, or the defences I should call them, the walls, they're not too close to the farms anymore, so it's like it's easier to at least try to do that. I think that might be, I don't know actually, is that a sake house that, I think. I'll just go back to the people because obviously if we've got more hammers and more builders and that lot I'd rather them get them now instead of like I don't know I don't like saying messing around but 
and it's like now I like the idea of cutting that down but if I can get four people every two days instead of two people you go for the four don't you it's just common sense seem to need these gems for everything but I'm not bloody finding them Oh, sorry mate, I didn't know you were all the way there. But, I do like the design and layout of Kingdom Two Crowns. I mean, don't get me wrong, I did like the first game as well, but I have to admit, it's, it's, impro it's an improvement. Usually with sequels, there's always something a bit dodgy about them. Well, not dodgy, but always something a bit weird about them, but no, so far this seems fine. Nothing wrong with it. Because it's like I said, I played the first one a lot more than I played this one. And it's like, when I was playing it, it's like I got a lot of uh, glitches in it. Not just the one you seen on the the last video but in general i've got a lot of glitches on it you know glitches like that before where they ended up stealing my crown but they didn't end up stealing it so yeah yay more builders so yeah it's one of those things sort of thing you're like there thinking Ugh. but i have to admit I don't think we'll have much issues with this one. Come on, my lovely builders. Build me the wall before it gets too dark. And I'm just going to refresh because my audio player thing. No, because I've disconnected. That's why it's gone a bit wrong. Bloody hell. Bloody Wi Fi. Thank you, my sweet builders. You're helping me more than you know. Ah! Ah! Look at all them builders. No, no, don't give me coins. Don't give me coins. I can't fit them in my purse. Oh. You all want to see me lose money, don't you? You want to see it dripping from my purse. Well, purse. Well, no, it would be a coin purse, actually, wouldn't it? Because it's an actual fabric thing. So, so yeah, it would be a coin purse. I was going to say, I've got a king, so I was going to say, should I call it a wallet? But then I thought, nah. No monsters today. What's the occasion? <clears throat> well, if that's the case, I'll just uh, get rid of a chunk of these. Marvellous. I think I'll give a chunk of coins to the ship. Just purely because, not just that I need to get it built, but it's I'm overloaded with coins, so if I don't start doing it, it's just gonna... Oh my god, did they get all the pieces for it? Straight away! <laughs> Bonus! Right, we don't ring that bell because I remember that gets them onto it. We don't take the gold either because I've not got room for it. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh my god, you do. You get the pieces for it. You don't have to invest a load of gold. That's the only reason I'm saving it all. They build the ship straight away. <laughs> Nice. Oh, oh, 
Ooh. Okay, I'm happy with that. Just sort of clear it all away. With my large amount of builders. Oh, I'm so happy I got all of these. Honestly, clearing things is so much faster. Ah, right, so they don't build it all, I don't think. Oh, wait, they do. No, sorry, they do. It's just I asked them to move the things. Yeah, keep the coins with you for now. Diamonds again. Bugger. Right, well, I won't run straight into it because, like I said, we don't know where the demon portal on the left side is yet. So it seems a bit of a dumb move to go right into it, especially when my horse has got very limited stamina. Yeah, and then we just put the two coins in it to set off, so that's actually really not bad. That's actually good. <coughs> that's it. Jug, 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 jug. You can actually hear him chewing the grass as well. That's good. Jug, 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 jug. No, don't start walking. All oh, right, you near the entrance. Fair enough, then. Yes, have a lovely little drink in the pond area. Yes, jog in now, because they're coming behind me. Jog along. There we go. <coughs> okay, let's see if there are any more people. <coughs> like I said the, well I said it on the first time I played the first game when you when you're dealing with the monsters it's not necessarily hard to do as long as you've got enough archers you know what I mean it, it's generally not hard to do but well it's not as complicated to do it but if you've not got enough archers this is where it starts to go but I know but I think so far from what I've seen on this level where the most effort comes in I think it's more um, <clears throat> cutting down the trees and that lot because if you can build a boat that quick like in a day anyone else here? no mate alright then so yes, this game is a very big improvement from the first. It's still enjoyable though to play the first though, I have to admit. Wanna get you before I go? So what I'll do is I'll give a chunk of the money to the banker. And then when I give a chunk of money to the banker and I've got a bit of a hole in my pocket, I'll go back for the treasure chest because I think I remember getting a gem from the treasure chest and this is what's bugging me. Right. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Do not give coins back. Num nuts. Yeah. <sighs> 
always useful to have another archer. And we'll have one more builder. Haha. <laughs> yeah, now I've got a hole in my pocket. We need a female for that. I'm going to assume that's a sake making place. Because <clears throat> I know you can make rice wine, I think. Oops. Yep, I forgot the demons are on route, are they? Yep, yep, can't run past it. But I will be moving the wall one more down. Oh, and it's turning more and more into a full moon, isn't it? Nice. So, I think when it turns into a full moon, is that when it becomes a blood moon? Fence there. <coughs> Builders, where are you? There you are. No, no, no. We do more. Oh, right, there's another one here. Bloody hell. Can't believe I missed that. Yes, and then do that one. Oh yeah, we need that treasure chest. A little bit of that treasure chest. Treasure chest. Right, we're not setting off the boat yet. <coughs> I need the jewels to help free that creature. Builders migrate over here. got someone here but obviously we need the diamonds which we ain't got. The demon gate must be near that. Oh there's another camp. Oh that's good. God it's so quiet and eerie at the same time. Okay, that looked like the pier then, but I have to admit, I didn't see a gate demon gate, so I don't know if it's on the pier. Which, to be fair, that would make a bit of sense. <laughs> now we need to get back in town. Oh, no. Demons are coming. Yes, carry the coins. But at least for now, I know I don't need to worry about any gates, you know, right as I'm going down, sort of thing. Half moon. Inside. And I think I'll get some more people after. 
after I've cleared more of that side because there is quite a lot of it to clear and I didn't realise it, you know, until last minute. I think there's another wall area there. I'm not too sure of that. Oh, there's another one there. Oh, sorry. it's so tempting to like build so much forward but it's it's along those lines as well where it's like yeah should we shouldn't we right so it's day 12 now always keep an eye on the days get the other four people in <laughs> So, six people in total we can get right now. to get rid of these. I might not have time to get rid of them but I will have time to build another fence to raise the defences but I'm not gonna build it too far down so to speak. <laughs> yes munch on some grass. Yum 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 yum. trust they'll make it back on time. Hopefully we all make it back on time. I think it's good though because I think this full moon is gonna line up with 20 days so that's a good way to keep track. Anyway I know all these are back in which is good. Oh wait yeah. Forgot about that, forgot about it. I'll sort that out on the way back. Try farming. Just purely because I just want to see if they start farming. Right, I'll get two more from down there because you might think we might not need them, but then so much stupid will happen, and I can guarantee you we're going to need them. 
but I need to give my horse a breath because he's quite exhausted. Sorry, my socks a bit funny. There we go. There they are. Really? Like bloodhounds, you usually sniff out the coins. <sighs> Back we go. Right, we need diamonds to upgrade this. We ain't got them yet. I don't know where you're supposed to find them. I thought it was in the treasure chest, but. He's an ancient beast here, it looks like. It looks like it's breathing. And I can't help it because I've got no diamonds. Arrgh. Right, two more people. We got two before, so that's four. Try and run past these because I don't want to stop and then get given a load of coins if I can't get rid of them. way banker eat the coins eat them yes put them away thank you trader lovely to see you again oh we need to upgrade. don't give me money banker what are you doing Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Do not give me money. If I ate it. Right. right. When I say don't give me money, it doesn't mean I want you to stop doing your job and shut the door in my face. It means stop filling up my purse because I don't need it here and I don't need it now either. So our farmers do work. Marvellous. So we don't have to rely solely on wildlife anymore, which is good. And there's another farm over here, so I think I'll do up this one. I actually thought you two were running back for a reason, then I thought, oh Christ, they broke through my fence. dead chuffed with that how the boat is just literally built. Nice. But I'm wondering, if I haven't got the stone part, how am I supposed to destroy the demon gate at the bottom? Because until you get the stone part, I don't think you can really um, get commanders, so to speak. So yeah, that's a bit of a conundrum. Only a little one. When you've got a minute, builders, I know you're busy and you're doing such a good job. Love it how they do it in sync. Douche, douche, douche. douche. <laughs> Holy crap! Man. Mm. I'm start getting given a load of coins. like the trees are just falling on you. Mm. 
Yeah, and it's like I said, you need to cut down the trees because obviously they can't get through unless you cut them down. And I think this is where most of the time is going to come from. <clears throat> you know, in the level. So in, it used to be the boat, whereas now I think it is just going to be cutting the trees down where most of the time comes from. No, just give me the coins, get it over with. Right, it's okay everyone, I've got enough coins, so if it goes a bit wrong, I can delay the monsters, <laughs> gradually. Definitely going to have to build some stuff a bit further down. Like, there's one right there, but I think that I'd be a bit too close. Oh, man, yeah. It's past the boat, in it, so... But I am confident we have got a lot of archers. And a new farm there. When I build it. Nice to see you all dawdling just slightly, but this is a blood moon now. Not a thingy one, so not a normal one. <laughs> Monsters. Don't think there is any tonight, thankfully. Alright, let's get the farm built. Day 14 or 15. I think you can either turn that into a rice wine house or a farm. But I wouldn't recommend turning it into a farm while the boat's here because they won't have room to grow anything. I mean, I wouldn't recommend getting farmers, sorry, while the boat's there because they won't have time to move into it in that respect. Oh, they won't be able to move into it until the boat's out of the way, sort of thing. Right, another wall there, but we don't need it yet. Don't have to panic about my builders getting back on time now. Oh, so annoying that when you can't just bloody get rid of the trees when you want to. Oh, more people. Okay, that's one. Right, well we know the piers this way. So, the good news is now, there's no portal on the right side, we know where it is on the left side. And the good news is, is that the base is right, just a bit more to the right, so it's not going to be a major issue to get people back and forth. Okay. Where have you gone to, builders? got stuff that needs doing here. I like how you don't have to move to every single tree either, you know, to get the coins. You can just stand in one spot. And it's night time again, and I didn't know. I don't 
figure these things out. It'd be nice if we could, um, because I know they're planning on bringing out another game, but it'd be nice if you could cancel an order. say like if it's situations like this where you've bugged up and you need to cancel an order quick it'd be nice if you could just press the button and they just immediately stop working sort of thing and just go back to the camp here. oh well, that's not too bad is that oh wait no it's not that's the house yes quick keep running don't look back keep running right that's built up properly Right, so I can't upgrade the house area. Until I get stone. It's the same for that as well. I can't upgrade that until I get stone. So yeah, I'm not sure what to do. can't do that. But I will build that. Don't want any accidents do we people because there's a bit of a ditch there with no bridge. Right, day 16. Yeah, so this has got me a bit curious. in terms of how are we actually going to transport our soldiers because we can because it's we've got no commander so we can't send them to the bottom unless the soldiers jump on as we're going down that might explain it a little bit all right if there's any more homeless people Make yourselves known because your camp's going down soon. Right, there was another person there. Bloody hell, mate. Sorry, I didn't see you there then. Maybe that one there. Hmm, yeah, build that one there now, actually. I like how the arches always get evenly split up as well every time you get one, so it's not like you need to worry about one one side, one the other. But I will get some more in, just in case the main gate side is having a tad bit of an issue. Bloody hell, Osh, you're doing good, aren't you? Usually your stamina's drained by now. Hmm. 
all the farmers, I forgot about them. So. Oh, bloody hell. No, 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 don't collect the coins. Right, I'll just start doing more archers. I appreciate the coins. Kind of. Right, no, I need the stone age for that. Okay. Add two more in. And the two more that are down there as well. Because I think we've got more than enough builders. We don't need to miver about the builders. Oh, I'll help you as soon as I can. But I don't think I'll be helping you on this island because we've not got the gems yet. But I think on this one you've got to destroy the main gate. I don't know actually. Yeah, so on this one, oh, that looks like a griffin, the silhouette. So there's a griffin, a girl, a main demon gate. I'm on day 16, so that's good as well. It actually tells you. I didn't notice this in the last one, so apologies if it was in the last one. But in the last one, I think it only told you in Roman numerals, like what the day was. Whereas in this one, it actually physically says, you know, 16 days have passed by. So that's good one main demon gate and there's one mini portal there's one silhouette of an archer statue one silhouette of a griffin it looks like or an eagle but i think it's a griffin and one silhouette of i'm going to assume it's the woman we need for the farm area but until we get the diamonds and things like that you can't really do anything you know what i mean sort of thing you can't really upgrade stuff to that extent so I would like to bring as many archers as I possibly can with me to the next island because it's like someone said once on one of my streams I can't remember who specifically but they said if you bring people it was good advice actually they said if they bring, you bring people with you then they following days you don't have to worry about attacks because you've already got your upgraded soldiers next year so yeah it's, it is pretty bad which is nice Ooh. oh my god you nearly shot one of the people then you bloody spanner Run past you lot. Ah, bloody hell! Yep, trader, go on. On your skew. Nice. Oh, bloody hell. Wrong one. Yeah, eat some food then. everyone just give me a quick minute while I just figure this out very quickly there we go marvellous oh bloody hell right on we go with cutting down the well they're not really I don't know actually I, I don't know actually yeah cutting down the trees yeah but bamboo is it I can't believe I'm going to say this now because I've never known it as a tree. I've always known it as bamboo. <laughs> we'll cut down the bamboo and trees. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah. I think this is it though. I think because you get loads of money. 
it's just better if you do upgrade everything you come across. Not necessarily straight away, but you know what I mean. Where are you going with my coin? You prick. Wow, I have a lot of coins. Was it to say more money than cents? <laughs> I think that'd certainly apply in this game. There's one screw up and that's it, you're screwed. See the daylight! Let it cleanse the forest! All the coins. Oh, well, with the daylight. Definitely, because the pier's there, flipping it. <laughs> you know what? If I can. Coins. I can't carry them all. Ah! <clears throat> oh, God, it's happening again. Mine. And I think what I'll do is over the next two days just build up these two as well. But considering... Actually, no, I'm gone. Until I'm ready to leave, leave. I won't do anything with the uh, bolt. Because I think you've got to ring that bell to get people on it. Also stuffed with excess cash at the minute as well, so I don't think I'll be even attempting to try to get an hold of any more money. Right, and the pier's right there. Seventeen are we on now? Maybe day eighteen. Mm. Right. And now all that is bashed down, I'm hoping, and this isn't done up yet, so I think we'll sort of uh 
get this built up just in case it uh, goes sour. I don't think the builders. Ah! No, 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 no! Don't go near him! Don't go near him! No! Leave the demon gate alone! Right, now I'll build the pole. Oh, come on. I think you come back to this island eventually to get rid of the main demon gate and this is why I want all the farms built up now. So if the farms are built up we've at least got like money makers when we get back. One little strand of air, it keeps itching my cheek. <laughs> and I'm like, yes! Right. I'm wondering though, should I wait until the morning? Because, ooh, if I wait until the morning, I know for a fact I've got time to get everyone to this. You know, the builders, the archers. I've got time for the builders to push it down. Well, there's no point doing it now because it is night time. And I feel like now I've at least left a little community behind for the people that have to stay behind. But from what I know, the monsters don't actually attack them either. Oh no, that's it, what I think farmers do. In the winter, farmers fish in the river. That's what I think they do. They don't work the land, but as long as you've got a farmer, I think they can still fish, so they can still get a little bit of money. Yes, 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 past the moon, come on. Sorry, just I'm just checking something. <coughs> right, night time, nearly over with. Nope, only halfway through. Okay, now it's nearly over with. Where do you go? Day 20. Now I think we need to get going. Just in case. Day 23 seems to be the cut off point, doesn't it? How do you move it forward? Are there any builders coming up to help? Yes, you are, thank God. That had my chest going then a little bit. See the little fish jumping in the river then. <coughs> Come my builders, we must depart as quickly as possible. Wow, wow! As long as the trees are bashed down, that really does get pushed. Come on, you lot! Oh, do my archers stay behind? I 
I hope everyone can hear that bell. I know it's a bit to run to, but... You. Yes. Right, so they do come. It just takes a little bit of time because obviously putting it nicely, it's a large area. There we go. Can't we get any more on? I'm wondering how many you're supposed to have for you. We'll give it another day and then we'll ring the bell tomorrow in the morning or after this wave's been defeated because I think they have to be within the vicinity to actually hear the bell. the bell a few times and then we'll set off because I don't know how many people you're actually allowed on the boat you might not actually be able to bring every single person with you <sighs> which sucks Day 21, I think. Day 21? Oh, day 20? Bloody hell, I thought that was 21. No, that, no, X is 10, so X, X is 20, so X, X1 must be, right, I'm sure that's 21. In my own way now, that is going to bug me a little bit. Then the amount of people that are allowed to come with you. Just stop getting tangled. Right. Well then. <clears throat> Fare thee well, my first land. Oh, 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 oh. Hang on. Right, yeah. That's it. Off we go. I still wanted to destroy that demon portal. So, build, explore, defend, conquer. Right. Very nice. Well, everyone, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it so far. I must admit, I do love the design and layout of this Kingdom 2 Crowns. It's fantastic. There's loads in it. I get the feeling we're going to have to find out some information on another land to tell us how to, excuse me, to destroy certain things and to get certain animals and certain people because obviously we still need to find out how to get the diamond. But yes, we'll find that out in the next video. Say bye and please stay safe.